it just comes naturally to them. It's a lot of a long t a lot of time just looking at their face and doing things. Oh, we got a quest over here. What's going on? You're not growing any younger, Grimmest. You must pass your knowledge on. I'm no trout that must get to its spawning ground. I should do what I please. Now leave me be. What's going on, guys? Do you need help? Yes. What do you seek? Kind old geezer I just saw you talking to. Who was he? One of our circle. Gremist. An exceptional alchemist. But a stubborn main ass. Well, been around sorceress is my share. Long enough to know that with great enlightenment comes even greater arrogance. But sorceress is welcome apprentices, am I right? Not Gremist. So many formulae in that head. So many methods of ingesting and absorbing lethal toxins. But he'd rather take them to the grave than share. Why is he averse to having an apprentice? How should I know? Perhaps because he's a stubborn mean ass. I like a mean ass. <laughs> that was a ramble. Ramble? Underground AV leaves a bit knee. Mashed with hyssop pollen. Oh, no, no. Not hyssop. Gridless. Yes, gridless. Or hemp bean. Two pinches. That guy wants to learn. Just needs to sit here and take notes, I suppose. Want to talk to you. But I do not wish to speak. Leave. You distress me. Distress you? You seem a nice enough guy. Well, I'm not. A plan never to be. I became a druid to avoid others. To not have to deal with them. Not to smile when I don't wish to. To feign compassion when someone's travails matter less to me than a pair of birch cones. So I shall be straight. Get out of my sight before something I know not what deprives you of yours. I want you to share your knowledge. Teach me alchemy. <laughs> you? My apprentice? <laughs> That's rich. While you're at it, why did you ask Uderic if he'll share Spickerog with you? I'm serious. <laughs> That's so. Don't make me laugh. I've devoted my life to alchemy. Sun, literary. Spent countless days and nights with nothing but alembics, choking on fumes, scorching my skin with acids. If you think I'll simply portray to you what I learned through years of sacrifice and toil, then you're mistaken. Deeply. There's, an, there's another perspective to that thing. Let's see what I can do here. Hmm, <laughs> that's not gonna be the one. Although I'm sure this would lead us somewhere, it wouldn't fail the quest. Can I convince you somehow? Oh, gods. You're as bothersome as a gadfly before a storm. Yeah, it's terrible. Awful. Hmm. Though I am preparing to perform a rather tricky ritual. So I could use some help. Even yours. I require three favors. Do them for me. And I shall accept you as my apprentice. Well, well. There's a way after all. Get off your high horse and listen. First, you must bring me a pimpernel from the Muskogan forest. A pimp what? Second, I need a bottle of spirit from the old distillery on Hale Hill. Finally, convince Fridjof to help me perform the rite. He's a druid like I am. You'll find him near Blandara. I believe he's there on a matter of some import. So, what will it be? Uh, let's see. So let's start with the Pimpernel. Hmm. A Pimpernel. As far as I know, it's got no use in alchemy apart from... Would you teach your grandmother to suck eggs? It's not any Pimpernel, but the one that grows in the Moscowden forest. And if the rumors are true, a creature jealously guards all the herbs growing there. Forest creature jealously guarding some secrets? Sounds familiar. Does it? Spirit. Why do you need that? As you must know, potential apprentice. Alcohol is the base for all potions. Superior alcohol means a higher quality potion. This spirit has no equal. Its strength. Its flavor. Oh. Unfortunately, 
the distillery at Top Hill Hill has fallen into disrepair. We've lacked a source ever since. But you'll manage somehow, won't you? You're so confident. Hmm. <laughs> this Fritjof, who is he? The Vader Maker, huh? You don't know the word, do you? And I pledge to make you my apprentice. A Vader Maker is a druid who can manipulate the weather. Wind Maker. Stop a storm, cause hail, make lightning turn your enemy to ash. I advise to address him no, with weather. utmost respect. Weather Maker. If you value your life. Vader? Weather? Yeah. I thought it was like v wind, vinder, but it would, yeah. All right, I'll do it. But this ritual you want to perform, what's that about? If ye wish to be my apprentice, you must stop asking questions. I decide what to tell you and when to do it. Now go, chop chop, before I change my mind. Oh, the <laughs> Mmm, that is a position there. Okay, uh, these, they were really he going head to head. Okay, let's do this mission before we go back to the main quest. Um, because it, le it looks like, uh... It looks like... He hit them. So we're looking Falling for... The still. Someone picked the bloom recently. Smell. Who's... Are we gonna really go after a... Seriously? Okay, I don't see, I don't see a red spot over here. Oh, there it is. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Another seeker of Pimpernel. Another? Grenister sent countless young druids into the forest. They hm. emerged drained, with a blank stare, and with no flower. And they never speak of what happened. I've asked Grenis to stop the folly. He looked at me and laughed. But the fun's over. One of our novices, Ramond, has failed to return. I've come to find him, alive or dead. Hmm. What do you know about this forest? Not much. Funny, isn't it? A druid should know every tree, every bush. But even we know not to venture to some parts of the isle. We can subdue animals, but not monsters. And the word is, one has made its lair here. A Leshen? An Axabron? Sadly, I don't know. Probably not a lesson. As I said, those who have entered do not speak of who or what they saw. Listen, you're looking for a druid, I'm looking for a flower. <laughs> Let's go in together. Why not? I could use the help of a tracker. Lead the way. Let's do this. Flower. No petals. Okay, so uh, what are we looking for? Oh, it, oh, there it is. That's the critical. It's so powerful, this this skill. It makes such a terrible noise as well. That it, it's so nasty. Okay. Yeah, I saw a red thing in here. Over... Over there. Oh, over here. An illusion? Someone buried him. No. Not skillfully, but with great care. Lots of scratches. None look lethal, though. Body's dried out as if it was drained. I knew him. It's Yara the White of Care Trolda. He died far from home. Oh, you got his body out. Yeah, he's missing an arm. Or it looks like it. Could be half buried in the... in the slope. Hoof prints. But a bipeds. It could be a succubus. The... The whole dryness thing and all that. They do that. Is there any other... There it is. Oh, there it is. Wait a minute. There's multiple tracks. There's two of them. Yeah, I would think a succubus could be anything else, really. Footprints. Some fresh, others faded. All leading in the same direction. Why did they come with a blank stare, though? Is she really that ugly? Oh, no, no. Oh, stop. Please. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, this is great. No, no, stop! It's a fawn. Please. Oh no, stop it's not. Stop it! That tickles. Oh, it's a succubus. Who can play this game, you horny goat woman? Unhand him, hellish creature! Ramond, step away from her. 
Ah, calm down. I've not been harmed. They came here. You don't know what you're saying. She's Is cast she... a spell on you. Yeah. We saw what happens to those who land in this beast's embrace. We saw Yara's body. Then you saw I buried his body as custom dictates. I did not seek his death. He he was very old. His heart was weak. I warned him it could end that way, but he kept returning. <laughs> I see through your lies. Your wretched charm won't work on me. I shall kill you here and now, monster. She might actually be casting spells, but they he returned, you know, you know, was it yeah. I don't see any reason to kill her. She's a monster, sure, but a sentient one, and basically harmless. No such thing. Just as there's no dry water, no cold fire. But if you'll not help, very well. I shall tend to her myself. I'd advise against it. I Are you sure? Return with one who does not carry a sword for show. Two swords for Why show. Why did you take my side? I'm afraid you'll be sorely disappointed. I don't generally couple with witches, especially oh. not out of gratitude. <laughs> Tell me why not. Is it the scars? I detest <laughs> when a man smells of blood. You witches always reek of it. Fiend blood, trot blood, and these are my brethren. You're right. But unlike fiends and chorts, you... Have ample breasts and a pretty face. Oh. I know. Their lack of these attributes. Is that what makes them easy to kill? The chort do it's have big tits. a bit more tits. complicated than that. But never mind. No means no, I get it. <laughs> is, red really, is that really what you wanted, Geralt? Can't think of another way you can repay me. I'm looking for Pimpernel. You know this forest. Maybe you could help me. I shall take you myself. And you, Ramund, go pick some more violets. Just the indigo ones this time. Uh, indigo? You mean blue? No. Indigo is indigo. <sighs> Men. <laughs> oh, boy. I'm not really sure this young druid is actually doing Why the good. you need all these flowers? Nosy, aren't you? Wait and see. Is she building a flower a bed of flowers or something? Yeah, she's just normal. Yeah, we did find one of these before. Although, yeah, it was a succubus. Yeah, that's right. Um, we, we found one of these, and she was working as a whore in uh, in a brothel, and we sent her away because apparently she killed somebody or something. In self-defense, I think, but it was kind of messy. So, hey, Geralt, just lay off the, the lady. So I thought it was going to be a fawn because I thought the voice from the guy was the fawn. It was, it was more of a effeminate voice from, a, from coming from a guy, so maybe a fawn would be portrayed like that in, in the... Pretty, don't you think? Bellflowers, violets, king cups, pimpernels. I must pick some edelweiss. Some, some what? Take one, but no more. I've put a lot of work into making this cavern cozy. Sure thing. Okay, so where can I get them? Oh, there's a lot. Oh, oh, it is pretty. I mean, it's not my cup of tea. But it is pretty. It doesn't seem very comfortable, though. You know, for the snoo 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 thing. Thank you very much. Can I say thank you? No, she doesn't even talk to me. It's a cool way of, of uh, dealing with the problem of the tail. They ask you to do the other one. So what one can I do? I bring you your sight lead to you. Not shut the windows. Did all the work. The doors. I don't like this. Uh, Look at him. Are you Fritjof? That's right. And what do they call you, Witcher? Me. Drifter, stranger, mutant. Sometimes even by my name. Girl of Rivia. <laughs> a man with a sense of humor. I like that. Well, what can I do for you, Girl of Rivia? Grimmest wanted me to summon you. Need you to help him perform a ritual. A ritual? Will this one stop him from being a mean old goat? I would go see him, for old time's sake, but I have more important matters on my mind. Look about you. The ground. See how dry it is. It's not rained for weeks. The grass and pastures has withered. Sheep are starving. I must bring rain. But fear that... Wait just a moment. Perhaps you could help me. How? I'm a man of many talents, but manipulating the weather is not one of them. 
I have in mind a different skill involving your sword. You see, Mother Nature dislikes it when you take something from her by force. She will defend herself so fiercely, in fact, that I could use a defender myself. What do you say? Sure, I'll help, provided you go see Gremist afterwards. Agreed. Now follow me. Time for a little storm. You also have a huge wolf. Idiot. Wait a minute, the wolf is shepherding the... That's not a wolf. Is that a wolf? It is. Of course it is. Animal sacrifice. Should we burn folk at the stake as they do on the continent? Better a sacrifice of goats and sheep, I think. Yeah. And the wolf is leading the goats, the, the sheep over. That's something. Skooka, swarm, fatna, hala. That's no way to kill a sheep. <sighs> it's starting. Okay, so I'm defending this guy. What are these? Oh, foglets. Okay. Flota himmel. The wolf kind of did well. A did you storm, take damn it! Shut up! I've not what he... managed a storm that fine for ages. Did you see the drops? The size of eggs. A little busy tending to the foglets. They weren't small either. Ah yes, unfortunately they always emerge. But perhaps that's for the best. For the best? Why? If manipulating the weather carried no risks, it'd not give me peace. Make it rain, make the sun shine. Some would want storms, others a sea calm as a pond frozen over. This way folk petition me only when their need is great, not because they've had a whim. I get it. There are times I wish I didn't have to chase this necker or that drowner. Hmm. <laughs> Will you go see Grimace now? With pleasure. After a storm of those proportions, I shall gladly have a... D Help him with his ritual. Till then. It was gonna say have a drink with him. And we leveled up. Awesome. He was gonna say have a drink with him. Really? Are they friends? They might be friends. And oh. So he wants me to get the booze, to get the friend, and to get the flower. I think the friend and the booze might be just secondary for the whole thing. And not necessarily part of the quest. Let's get the, the booze, then. Oh. We're really going uphill. Yep. It's quite a steep incline over here. Good stuff, good stuff. And there it is. Did we come here before? Oh, we probably didn't. Oh, man. Even Roach is having issues. Okay. We have ghouls here. Weren't we warned about this? I think we were. And we also have goats. Oh, there's a monster in here. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, it's a cyclops. Hello, sir. Breath's downright flammable. <laughs> I love this. I love this when this happens. Cyclops won't bother me anymore. Nope. Can look around peacefully now. Well, you weren't looking around when he was around, that's for sure. It's not like, mm, -mm now I can look around peacefully before I couldn't. Yeah, you can now you can look around, period. Not peacefully, period. I know it starts with a P. What is that? Let's go up up here. This sound this looks suspicious. It doesn't sound suspicious. It is. Got lucky. Bit of mash left. No, that was just me being really awesome at this game. What is this? Okay, so I need to put the mash in there and then activate those things. Let's see. The Steeler's Log. Okay, sounds like a plan to read, and there's another thing over there. Bunch of loot around. Breen Shy. Distilling recipes. Parchment's a little faded, but legible. Okay, let's see how legible it actually is. Um, I would think that it's on this side. Yes, it is. Mm. 
That's a contract? Yeah, okay. So over here, what do we have? We have the mash and we have the distiller's log. Damn, beast has come around again. Refused to go till I poured some spirit in the basin. Till I filled it to the brim. I, I, it drank it all in one slurp and left. Not a week's pass, then it comes again. I threw, sto it, I threw stones to chase it off, then I threw stones back, then it threw stones back, and broke three of my ribs. Howled and screamed till I poured some more. I've gone through my ledger that plowing beasts drank half my supply. I shan't give it another drop no matter what. Think it's time I called for a witcher. Yeah, but he didn't. Tialfe, I'm giving you one last chance. Aya, either do something properly or your apprenticeship is over and you can start packing your bags. Here are your instructions. Read them twice and make sure they make it into that watery brain of yours. Put the mash in the evaporator. Light the fire on the, the evaporator. Cool the condenser. First, turn the right lever and then the left, not the other way around. Now, is that hard? No. The answer is no. So get to work. Dagfin. P.S. Don't toss rotten melt uh, malt out behind the distillery, dump it in the stream, otherwise someone will catch a whiff of something and come investigate. That's unrelated to this thing. Okay, so we need to just do a few things. Should be okay. Should be totally fine with our signs and magic. Okay. So. Here's where the mash goes, probably. Yes. It's... Game? Oh, it's weird. Don't worry. Done. Now to boil the mash. Sim simple enough. Is that it? Well, there it is. Now to cool the. Ought to be enough. Time to cool it down. This thing. Does that? Ought to be enough. Time to cool it down. And now it works. But now I should pull the right lever. Yeah, I screwed up before because I pulled the levers before the quest got started, so that was what the problem was. Well, well. See? Turns out I'm quite the distiller. Yeah, I just broke the quest before. That was the problem. How do you get the stuff back? Oh, this thing? Oh, come on, Geralt. Don't get drunk in this. There we go. We got it. Wasn't that hard? It was actually quite hard. Because you, you, you try out things before and you screw up everything. I screw up everything. You don't. Uh, okay, so let's go back to Gremist. Gremist was his name. Yep. Uh, he's a kilometer away, but we have a teleporter right here. That is gonna let us go right there as well. Pretty good stuff. Man, he's far away. Um, and that uh, will allow us to go back to the main quest and uh, continue looking for Siri. Not actually looking for Siri, looking for help in looking for Siri. Hello. Always oh, underground. In his little cave. Please don't die, Geralt. Over here. Did everything you asked. Phenomenal, my boy! So, Fritjof, shall we begin? The sooner the better. We've a long night ahead of us. They just wanted Fritjof a drink. Fritjof only for members of the inner circle. Thus, my dear apprentice, you must wait outside. Under no circumstances must you enter. We shall begin your tutelage come morn. Will you finally tell me what the ritual's about? Nay, nay. No one likes a meddler. Suffice to say, it's a burning matter now. Shoot! Hmm. Wait till the next day. Sounds like a plan. Meditate. Over there. Should be enough. Right? <laughs> I think so. There it is. Are we good? Yeah, we are. Let's go inside. We must have another. That's good stuff. Aye, as the bears from Moosh Gordon. And spare from Hail Hell. Good times, Fritjof. <laughs> good times. Finally, something other than damn potions and transmutations. Guess the ritual's not over yet. Good. I thought I told you to 
stay outside. Only dreads in the inner circle. Circle, Smirkle. Let the boy <laughs> have some fun. He's earned it. <laughs> Fine. Pour yourselves on. Good. Let the lessons begin. Yeah. Drink hard and study hard. I like the idea. Yeah, yeah. I call it stimulation and assimilation. First you stimulate, and then <laughs> you assimilate. Not sure it works like that. Down. I shit down. I... <laughs> Let's start with ingesting toxins. Best approach, practice makes perfect. Mm -hmm. I've practiced a lot already. Good thing. I'll make learning my secret method easier. Look, you take the potion like this, and go. Who said old age is a burden? Well, you're drunk, and I hate that. I absolutely hate that. Stupid Geralt. Okay, did we do... We completed the quest. And uh, I hate this, so let's meditate until the morn. Should be okay. We're gonna have a hell of a hangover on the other day, but that's okay. And let's go continue. Uh, first, we're going to crack. Yeah, not... We're not going to crack. We're gonna, you know, meet crack. That's, that's what I mean. Uh, and uh, that is a little bit of way, but it should be fine. It's actually quite a lot of way. Let me use the... Uh, the map over here so I can go there. Actually, Ermion is pretty close, so I might as well just go for Ermion. Let's go meet Ermion. Hopefully he's gonna help us, but... Uh, I don't know, though. I don't know. I mean, we, d we didn't support him in, in his quest for, for becoming king. Wasn't this where they crowned her? Yeah, this is where they crowned her. Why is he over here? Also, he didn't do the quest for the guy that couldn't hear. You guys remember? Uh, at the end of the stream, we found a quest near here from, from a guy that apparently had a friend that was deaf or something. Can we talk? Oh, it's this guy. Oh, I thought it was the other one. Uh, ooh, yeah, please. Wouldn't happen to play Gwent, would you? Certainly. I got my first deck, oh, years ago, back in Sintra. Proceeded to teach the game to half of Skellige. Why do you ask? Looking to play? Oh, I'm looking to win. Yeah, glad to play around. That was pretty good. Pretty tight. This guy is strong. This guy is pretty powerful. Okay. So moving on with the quest that we Lord came here. My congratulations. To get his help. You have a good deck, but it could use a bit of supplementation. Please do. Here, take this card. Thanks. You have a knack for it. So much so you ought to challenge Crack. I gave him his deck, introduced him to the game, but the pupil has surpassed his master. There's also Grimmest, a vile character, but yeah, one against him already. talented. <laughs> a vile character. Can we talk? Yen and I went to Hindersfjall. Oh? Did you learn anything? Siri came through Lofoten. She was wounded when she arrived. Villagers nursed her back to health. Sadly, the wild hunt was on her trail. Followed her there. Siri managed to escape, but the villagers... I know. You needn't finish. I later spoke to those who survived. Suffice to say, Siri was fortunate to escape. I trust you'll find her soon. She has been basically trying to run away from the uh, wild hunt ever since the beginning of the game. What do the druids think of Skellige's new ruler? On great blood is good blood. Yet Ceres is the first woman to rule Skellige. Ever. Not everyone's pleased. There are seven clans in Skellige. Each would like a king from their own line. But Ceres will manage. She's not as impulsive as Shalmar. Thinks first, then acts. With Krach as her advisor, she has every chance to be a good queen. I think so. You were made a Hierophant. Congratulations. I thank you. The Skelliger Circle chose me years ago, about the time when the old disputes between the clans were reigniting. Job's been mainly politics then. Aye, but I've not minded. Since time immemorial, the druids have wandered betwixt the clans, keeping endless feuds in check. We care for equilibrium, the balance of all things, 
not just trout populations in streams. We're lucky the Earls always valued us as advisors. Lucky. The war. Curious to know your opinion. Well, I believe Emia's chosen a poor time to wage it. Hard to find any better as I see it, with the North now in disarray. Yeah. The North is weak, true. But I've the impression the Emperor is dealing with some domestic strife. Oh, yeah. Far too much to start a war. Radovid is a madman, but a cunning one. He's certain to take advantage. He's trying to, actually doing the right things. The Wild Hunt will attack Kaer Morhen soon. Gonna need your help. The Wild Hunt? Are you certain? So, uh, you found Ciri? I know where she is. And the Wild Hunt will also learn that as soon as I find her. I see. That's gonna I be something. I immediately. Leave tomorrow at the latest. Thank you. No need. I raised the girl and I've still a duty to her. I shall see you at Kaer Mohan. There we go. Hello, sir. And he, this is a very lovely little place, as a matter of fact. Telling you, Geralt. Since you and Yalmer defeated the Ice Giant together, I see you as one of our own. I got the look of a Skelliger. You've got the heart of an Uncrate. And I got the cards as well. Your daughter. First woman to rule Skellige. She'll be a good queen. Knows what she wants. Yeah? So what does she want? To unite all of Skellige's clans. A difficult task. No one has ever managed it. But Ceres is stubborn. Thinking long term, then. Think she'll succeed? She's got a powerful ally. In me. The massacre during the feast. Know anything new? Thanks to you and Ceres, we know who's responsible. It's enough for me. Not gonna try to capture the berserkers? They were but tools, Wolf. I'd rather sever the hand that wields the sword than merely break steel. You ever play Gwent? Ha! Ermion taught me the rules and gave me a deck. Wish to play? Are you still playing with your beginner, beginner's deck? Let's play a quick round. Oh, it's not gonna be that quick. Oh boy, uh, but it, it... And let's see, 74? 86! Not bad, against one. Yeah, it's a quite clear defeat. You're good. Know what, Wolf? I've this rare card here. Take it. It'll be of more use to you. Thanks. You if it's might like... consider challenging a man in Kertrolda village. A worthy adversary, though a mere tailor. Just as his name. Oh, I'm gonna pay him a visit. Drog. I got a Drog. That's a terrible card. Wanted to talk. Soundtrack right now. This isn't easy, but I need to ask you a favor. A big one. Tell me, friend. Siri, I know where she is, but I also know that as soon as I reach her, the Wild Hunt will know I did. They'll come after us, attack, and we'll need to respond with strength. Can I count on you? The Black Ones first, now Wraiths. Such is life. Bring her here, and we'll face them in battle. Not here. What's this about the Nilf Guardians? Of late, look seaward and you'll see their son on a sail, staring right back. We've yet to capture any of their crew, but only a fool wouldn't know they're planning something. But fear not, we'll banish the Black Ones and the Wild Hunt. Two birds with one skeleton axe. <laughs> <laughs> Siri will be safe in Kaer Trold. Yeah. Can't risk your men's lives. Kaer Morhen, we fight them there, nowhere else. Kaer Morhen is hundreds of miles away. To move an army there would take weeks. Not to mention, I'd expose the Isles to Nilfgaard's blows. Geralt, forgive me, but I cannot do it. I understand. Won't take up any more of your time. Farewell. Wait. Won't let you leave empty-handed. I'll help as I can. Come with me. Oh. 
beautiful craftsmanship. Got a talented smith. Not I. King Erland on Crate did. Erland Stonefist? So this is Winter's Blade. Thought it was a legend. Forged in Mahakam, tempered in dragon fire. Been in the Oncrate family for centuries. And now, it's yours. I can't take this. You can. You must. Let me do this much, at least. If you insist. Thank you. Well, it's not going to get any use. It's an interesting weapon. May it serve you well. Send those specters back where they came from. That's my intention. Farewell. It's more of a spear than a than a sword. You notice the head of it? That was She's above. So I need to find a way to keep climbing in this castle. This is the one. Man. I did not come to pray. This is well guarded. It's really hard to access though. Oh, she's in a room. Hello, Ceres. Your Royal Majesty. Would you spare a moment? Come on, Geralt. I'm the same lass I was, save for the title. A lot of things changed. How's it feel to rule? Jarl's giving you any trouble? They're all very understanding. They seem to believe in me. Besides Lugos, of course. Tried talking to him? Could still win him over. I don't know about that. He's more mule-headed than my father, but I'll try, of course. Got a delicate matter I wanted to bring up. Need your help. What is it? Crocs mentioned Siri to you. He must have. Have you found her? Not yet, but I'm close. Problem is, as soon as I get to her, the Wild Hunt will probably be able to locate us quickly. So I'll want to take her to Care Morin. She's not gonna come. the hunt there. I'm looking for allies. I can't leave the Isles now. Yeah. It's impossible. What I can do is give you my best warrior, Yalmar. Think you'll be willing? I'm sure of it. In fact, I think I'll be overjoyed. Come on, you know him. Yeah, yes yeah. I do. Thanks. No doubt he'll be valiant. I hope he proves useful too. Good luck. Thank you. I need to talk to him, but... Well, deliver the good news, I guess. Oh, it's through here. Oh, they have... They still share kind of the same hall? That's not how it used to happen. Why are you still around here, man? Shouldn't you be leading your own clan or something? Nice crib, though. Who's drinking? Ah, Geralt. How are things? Got another voyage in mind? Of course. Ice Giant was just the beginning. Besides, I got all kinds of horse sons already saying he wasn't that big. What about the folk of Umgik? He wasn't that big. You and your men were gonna help them return to their isle and rebuild Urskar. Ceres will take care of that. Hmm. <laughs> you and Ciri, as I remember, you two grew up together, at least for a while. Aye. Spent half her childhood in the Isles. Always at my heels she was. Scrawny wee thing. But her leaps on ice skates. Why, none of us could rival them. Tried to outdo her once. Smashed me mouth on a rock. And then <laughs> you went to Krach and announced you'd agreed to wed. You hear of that? Aye. We had twelve winters on us. Both. Mm. Any thought of continuing that romance? Me da whipped it out of me head. <laughs> Wonder what it'd be like to see her now. Hmm. I wonder why. Maybe because he felt she was like a, a daughter to him? The Wild Hunt's preparing to attack Kaer Morhen. Could use <laughs> your help. Rates at the gate of your Witcher's stronghold. You're a friend of the clan. I cannot refuse you. What's more, no one crates ever stood and battled such a foe. I'll leave at once. Thanks. Won't forget this. He's gonna be. He's gonna be a, probably the best Skellige warrior seeker. if he just pulls that off. 
And there we go. Brothers in Arms in Skellygate is completed.